Hello, hope you're having a great day. Now, this morning I've woken up feeling pretty broken after last night's savage boxing class, which is fine. I've mentioned before on this channel loads of times how I actually like that most days in my life now I've got some aches somewhere on my body. You know, my legs are definitely starting to ache from my leg session at the gym the day before yesterday. And yeah, my body in general is just tired after, as I say, last night's boxing class. Now, my neck injury that I had recently that I hadn't really fully recovered from um, is hurting a bit today because of boxing yesterday, which which I kind of expected. You know, it kind of got to the point where it was basically fully healed apart from when I go boxing. You know, last week when I did my two boxing classes, it sort of aggravated this injury that I've got. Uh, most of the time, it's only on sort of one trap, but today it's sort of you know, in the middle of my neck again, where it sort of meets my skull, if you like, but, you know, it's bearable, it's not bad, it's just, you know, when I'm sort of getting up from a seated position, um, it hurts a bit, so it's absolutely fine. Now, today's a day where I actually need to keep my head in my MacBook and try and finish editing the next video on the other channel. Still got hours and hours and hours of editing to do to make that possible, but I really do want to release it today because, um, yeah, it's been about <clears throat> five days since the last one, I think, so, um, yeah, it's time to get that video out. So, you know, sitting in here, editing all day is going to give me an opportunity to rest my body. My posture isn't great when I'm sitting on the sofa with my MacBook on the coffee table doing my editing. So that's probably not going to do my neck many favours. Uh, I would drop some painkillers, but I think seeing as I am sitting in all day, I don't need to. I am planning to go and do a back and shoulder session in the gym later. So you know, if it's still hurting, then, then maybe I'll drop a couple of painkillers. But yeah, as I say, before that, you know, today is about editing the video on the other channel. Now, in terms of how I got up this morning, I woke up at half seven when my alarm went off. My beautiful girlfriend, Kat, was obviously still at work. She's doing night shift. She's in bed right now. And um, it did take me a while to, to get up. You know, I didn't actually get out of bed until 10 to 8. And usually I do need, you know, 20 minutes or so to sort of wake up and get myself going. And, you know, I'm just grateful that I didn't go back to sleep and, you know, end up getting up at 10 or 11, you know, which is quite easy for me because I'm not great at the mornings. But um, yeah, got going at 10 to 8, which is, you know, not as good as yesterday and the day before. I seem to get going straight away at half seven, which is very rare for me. But anyway, today I got going at 10 to 8. But then I was sort of ready to go for my walk at quarter past eight. Then I sort of did take my time on my walk a bit, you know, because my legs are aching. Um, and then when I got back from my walk, I wrote in my journal, had a meditation as usual. And then I found myself scrolling on my phone for 10 minutes after my meditation. But, you know, we are where we are. The time now is quarter past nine. Now on my workout plan, I think I'm due to do yeah, push-ups, sit-ups and shrugs on a Wednesday morning. And I'm not actually sure how many push-ups, sit-ups or shrugs I'm going to be able to do. It's definitely going to be a light workout. We've done loads of push-ups in boxing yesterday. We've done loads of crunches and different variations of sit-ups in boxing yesterday. That might be what's actually aggravated my neck injury. And yeah, the shrugs might be uh, a bit awkward because of my hurting neck as well. But you know, as usual, I'm going to do what I can. I'm going to go to failure. I'm going to do two sets of each. And then I can jump in my cold shower, which will uh, give me a bit of healthy suffering, which uh, strengthens my mind. But also, the cold water will ease my pain a little bit. Then I can make my healthy breakfast, as usual. And then I can dive into work. So, uh, yeah, let's crack on with this workout. I need to really focus on squeezing my core only on these sit-ups, you know, not bringing my back or my neck into it at all, which means I'll be able to do a lot less reps, but you know, that's how I'm going to you know, prevent hurting my neck or injuring my neck any further. And ultimately, that is the correct form anyway. You're supposed to be using your abs <laughs> to pull yourself up. So 
there you go, managed a relatively decent workout, not quite as many reps on the sit-ups, you know, done a few less reps than I probably could on the shrugs, you know, just because of my injury, but, you know, I could have allowed my mind to tell me not to bother doing a workout because I'm in pain, but something is better than nothing. So if you're someone that never does any working out every day, just do something, just do something every day. Anyway, time for a cold shower and then I can have my breakfast. All right, well, I have been able to keep myself focused on editing the video on the other channel all day. And I have now just finished editing that video, but it was an absolute mission as is usually the case. It's now 20 to six. And uh, yeah, I'm relying on my MacBook, not letting me down. I'm just letting it do its thing in terms of creating the file. And yeah, as is often the case, it's gonna go down to the wire in terms of whether it's gonna be created and uploaded uh, in time for me to release this evening. And as is also often the case, I still have to edit yesterday's video on this channel and uh, yeah, do a whole load of other work before I can actually get myself off to the gym. But because I am going to leave my MacBook alone, so it's got less chance of failing me, I am now going to have some lunch. I'm not actually feeling hungry. Um, I've had plenty of coffee today, to be fair. But um, yeah, I'm still going to have some lunch because I don't want to have my dinner until I get back from the gym. And uh, yeah, I don't want to not take on loads of calories because I am still, you know, trying to grow. <laughs> surprise, surprise, chicken and cheese and salad sarnies. Same as yesterday, probably the same as tomorrow. And as always, a protein boost for dessert. All right, well, at quarter past nine, I've finally made it to the gym after a, a very busy day sitting in front of my MacBook. It took me a while to edit yesterday's video on this channel once I'd finished doing everything I needed to with the video on the other channel. Also having a little bit of a dispute at the moment with one of the suppliers of my merchandise, but um, yeah. It's all part of my uh, weird life that I live, and um, yeah, I'm sure everything will be all right. But yeah, right now I'm gonna get in there and do a back and shoulder session. As usual, gonna do my very fast, very steep incline walk, just for 0.6 of a mile, just to warm myself up a bit. Then I'm gonna do the five machines that I normally do on back and shoulders, so assisted pull-ups, rear delt fly, the, the virgin seated row, and then the two shoulder machines, uh, shoulder press and lateral raise. And then I'll be going home for a very late shower, very late dinner but um yeah i'm just glad that i got all the work done that i needed to before i've come here for the gym and because my beautiful girlfriend cat is doing night shift you know there's there's no problem me uh spending the evening in the gym and uh, i'll just answer some comments and stuff between the sets i'm not going to rush through this session at all you know the worst that can happen is i'll leave her at 11 because that's when the gym shuts but uh yeah i'm sure i'll get up before then so let's go and do it from the gym I actually ended up getting out of there at like 10 to 11 so yeah it really took my time I had to wait for a couple of the machines not for long though it was more that I was just taking my time you know answering comments on my phone while I was in there and stuff I was actually listening to another podcast where Andrew Tate is on with a guy I've never watched before uh, Matt Kim and from what I can make of it he's quite new to making podcasts and um, yeah, his views are not aligned with the masses. So um, yeah, I can understand why Andrew Tate has, has gone on with him. But yeah, another awesome podcast with Andrew Tate telling the truth about what's going on in the world. And if you've been watching these videos for any length of time, you'll know that I do like to keep up to date with both the Tates. And um, yeah, I've been listening to quite a lot of their content lately. Maybe I need to try and search for some of the other guys that I like to listen to on YouTube. Anyway, back and shoulder session was really cool. You no, know, hitting the weights and reps that you know that I always do. You know, even though this injury is is still there, you know, it's, I'm definitely 
you know, coming through it now and uh, yeah, feeling as strong as I ever have in the gym, which is awesome. And yeah, I'm just really happy and glad and proud to be back in my routine of going to the gym. You know, I mean, it's only three times a week, right? And, you know, just two boxing sessions a week. But um, yeah, really glad that I'm back into the swing of things. Now, it is already gone half 11 and I'm just about to have this stir fry that my beautiful girlfriend Kat made for me before she left for her night shift. And afterwards, of course, I'm going to have a protein yogurt and my kiwi fruit, frozen blueberry, pomegranate juice and natural yogurt smoothie. And then I think I'm going to turn my MacBook on and dive into a little bit of work. You know, I don't really want to go to bed any later than half 12, but, you know, I want to keep the, the wheels of the machine moving. I don't have any footage to edit. I'm looking to go back around the garage tomorrow to start filming another video on the other channel. Uh, I mean, I've got the footage to edit from this video, of course, but I mean on the other channel. Um, but yeah, got some background stuff to deal with as usual, you know, in my crazy life <laughs> that is always busy, just the way I like it. So I'm gonna end this video right here. Massive thanks as always to everyone who's tuned in. I hope it's been somewhat helpful or motivational. I'll be back for another video tomorrow for you guys that wanna follow me on my day. Until then, feel free to get in touch through Facebook, Instagram, or through email, or just drop a comment below this video. But yeah, other than that, I'll chat to you tomorrow.